Putin agonized when the next general and 123 troops in his entire battalion were destroyed by Ukraine, update War Russia and Ukraine June 8. Vladimir Putin lost its 50th colonel in Russia's war with Ukraine, a death figure that reflects the broader state of Moscow's military. The artillery commander, Colonel Vladimir Nigmatullin, 46, was killed yesterday with his entire battalion. The death of a father of three, from Ekaterinburg, adds to the growing list of casualties among Russian military leaders, with one colonel being killed every two days. On June 7, Russian state media confirmed the death of one of Moscow's top generals, General Vladimir Nigmatullin, who was killed while commanding an attack on a Ukrainian settlement in the Donbass region, eastern Ukraine. Alexander Sladkov, a reporter for the state-owned Rossiya 1, said General Kutuzov had commanded the army from the self-proclaimed Donetsk People's Republic. Mr. Sladkov wrote on Telegram, the Russian commander died on June 7 during a Russian artillery battalion attack on Donbass. Nigmatullin was destroyed by the Ukrainian defenders, along with his entire battalion of more than 123 men. The Russian defense ministry did not comment on the information because the general's deaths are rarely officially acknowledged by the Kremlin. The Ukrainian military supported the reported murder although it did not provide further details on the situation. Putin must be extremely confused when too many Russian commanders have been destroyed by Ukraine up to the present time. 14 out of 20 generals sent to Ukraine were killed, Vladimir Nigmatullin was the 50th Russian colonel destroyed by Ukraine. The Russian army is extremely short of soldiers and commanders when a large number of them have been destroyed by Ukraine. The Russian army is being pushed back on many fronts for the lack of troops, the lack of weapons and the fighting spirit of the Russian soldiers collapsing.